Hi and welcome. My name is Julianne Cost, and in the next few minutes we're going to discover how to convert our images to black and white with control in Lightroom. So in the basic panel we do have the option to choose between color and black and white, but if we choose black and white we really don't have any control over how all of the different color ranges are converted to grayscale. So let's scroll down and select the black and white panel. Here you'll notice that I have different sliders for each of the different color ranges. And by default, Lightroom is actually looking at the image and doing an auto conversion based on the colors in the photograph. But of course, we can always override those. I can do that by either moving the slider, so you can see that I could move the red range of the original image to convert it into a lighter color or to a darker color. I can do that with a slider or we can choose the targeted adjustment tool. And the targeted adjustment tool, by the way, you can select using the keyboard shortcut, Command Option Shift and then G for grayscale, and that would actually take you to this panel if you had a different panel active. All right, so let's click in the image area and drag down. You can see that that's going to move not only the red slider, but also the orange slider down. Now, if you can't remember what the original colors were in your image, sometimes it can be helpful to tap the Y key. The Y key will give you a before and after so that we can check and just see what the original colors were. So now I know that this back area was kind of a cloud area. It's got a little bit of a blue tint. So I'm going to click there with the targeted adjustment tool and drag up in order to lighten that area. Or if I want to add more contrast, we can click and drag down. I might actually like the darker background, but I might want to change my mind on the red value. So I'll click there and just drag up, making that figure brighter and kind of popping it to the foreground a little bit more. Excellent. So let's tap the Y key again to get out of before and after view. If I tap the V key, which is the shortcut for going to black and white, you can see that I can reset this to color. Tapping the V key again will bring me back to black and white and it remembers the black and white mix that I'd previously set. So there you have it, an easy way to convert color images to black and white in Lightroom.